Cynthia and Amy, this is still a very active crime scene now exactly three hours after that shooting happened. If you take a look behind me, you can see, well, the cab is still there. That police car is actually blocking where that cab is. And it was just about five minutes ago that uh, investigators removed that body as they continue their work tonight. Police tell us it was around 3 o'clock this afternoon. That cab driver pulled up to a home here on Spruce Avenue and called the customers to come out to the vehicle. But police say those customers never made it out to the cab because they heard gunshots. A woman nearby tells us there were about five or six of them, one right after another. When police arrived, they found the victim dead at the wheel inside the cab. Now officers are trying to figure out who did it and why. Crime scene's processing. Uh, detectives are out. We've got every available unit out that we're driving around. License plate reader car, everything's out. And the yellow cab company has confirmed that the victim is one of their drivers, though they will not give us an identity. And there isn't any information this time as for a suspect or a vehicle or anything like that. We'll continue to follow this story and bring you the latest as it develops. Live on Kansas City's east side, Zach Tecklenburg, 41 Action News.